Mr. Shoplin, uh, we are talking uh, just ahead of um, uh, the hearing organized by the Liberal Alde Group uh, on the question of the Hungarian media law. Uh, what is your expectation from this hearing? Were you yourself invited to take the floor? Uh, how, that, how did it happen? Well, I simply heard, learned about it because it was uh, advertised in Parliament. I hope I will be given the floor. What is highly regrettable is that an offer by the Hungarian government to be represented at ministerial level was, re was rejected by the organizers. Uh, do you think that uh, uh, the Liberal group uh, ha have read uh, actually the law? Uh, do you think that they are well prepared for this discussion? Well, I hope that some of them have read the law, but quite honestly, I don't think the discussion is really about the content of the law anymore. It's about the media avalanche, uh, which is attempting to bury Hungary at the very beginning of the Hungarian presidency. Bad timing? Bad timing, yes, possibly. Uh, maybe the media law should have been passed in February or March, or possibly after the presidency. But as I say, it simply became a pretext uh, to attack Hungary in exactly the same way uh, as other of the new members have been attacked, because the Western press and Western politicians like to export their own guilt feelings eastwards. So the problem is not the law, it's, it's the timing, right? I'd say no. Uh, the problem is the law to some degree because it's become given a pretext but secondly it's a much deeper structural issue that many of the new members the EU 15 really don't care to regard the 10 new members as completely equal to them and I think that's where uh, the dog is interred. Thank you.